Liam rang me up in the middle of the night. They were up one night about half past one and said, Will I sing in a thousand? I think that was a Saturday and it was to be recorded the following one to week, so I didn't have a lot of time, I suppose, to make up my mind. But uh, I don't really sing too much. I'm going to sing a song here. Um, um, I could count exactly in two hands how many songs I even know. So, uh, but I'm going to sing this song called Banshee Teddy Bear. And um, Ned Egan is a, so a poet, a songwriter, playwright from <coughs> Kilkenny. I think he's from near Mother Bat. Um, and we heard this song in a local pub called, uh, or at least the area is known as the State Park, um, John Delaney's pub, from a guy called uh, Paddy Shea, a great singer from Pilltown in Kilkenny. So this is written by, written by um, uh, Ned Egan. So, just tear into it. I, I always think that if, if the song is a good enough story that, that anybody can sing it, I suppose that's why I can you know, get away with singing it. Um, okay. When we were small, she used to kiss me sweet and call me Teddy Bear. And when she falls, I tell her of a giant to live somewhere in County Clare. Then hand in hand, we'd walk the fields, sometimes she'd make a dizzy chin. And then we'd stand and skip flat pebbles on the little pools of summer rain. And the days of sun and roses are not meant to last forever. And the years are flying like swallows. So let all the few beware. When the flower of summer closes, you may use your best in There's no banshee teddy bear. And at nineteen, I used to see her laughing in the village hall. And she would lean on someone else's arm at the autumn harvest ball. I'd catch her eye. And she would smile and wave, and then she'd turn away. And she was by with someone else until the dawn of yet another day. <coughs> and the days of sun and roses are not meant to last forever. So let all of you beware. When the flower of summer closes, you may use your best endeavor. But in winter's hills and hollows, there's no banshee teddy bear. At fifty-nine, I sometimes think. My heart had been only brave that she'd be mine, but now instead she's just a hungry mountain barren slave. I give no sign, but I would like to touch her silver speckled hair, like she touched mine in childhood days when I was her own bench a teddy bear. And the days of sun and roses are not meant to last forever, and the years are flying like swallows, so that all of you beware. When the flower of summer closes, you may use your best endeavor, but in winter's hill.